Yo, 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 what is good, y'all? It's your boy G Money the Kid 92, aka Shabba Diocho, man. Here with a video. Alright, so for y'all who don't know the story, man, I, I've been playing Mutt from the jump. I got early release. I played, you know, I had a better squad than I do now, but I ended up quitting Mutt. You know, I was gonna play ranked, but some homies talked to me, you know, so we back, we back on Mutt, man. So I've been grinding, doing solos, you know. With a couple of donations and stuff, so I'm back to 87 overall. So I'm gonna show y'all the squad, man. This is gonna be my first lineup update, man. Uh, throughout the year, I could do lineup updates. You guys just gotta let me know. Let me know in the comment section, man. And I'll be gladly to bring you the videos, man. But alright, check this out. We got Joe Staley at left tackle, man. The man is, he's good. Like his run blocking is very good, very decent. Uh, 88 impact block, 92 run block. You know, we're going to try to upgrade the squad. You know, I've been trying to stack up coins so I could get back Walter Jones and Steve Hutchison and all that. But it's going to take time. We got Leary. He's good. Um, Jason Kelsey, definitely good. As a center, he's he's good. And on top of that, he's an eagle. You feel me? Look at that. 94 run block and 92 impact block, man. Impact block makes a big difference in here. We got Brooks and we got Lane Johnson. You know, I got to have my eagles on the squad. Uh, we got Travis Kelsey, he's a goon, I need to get his better card, um, Lee Smith, he's good at run blocking. Alright, for my receivers, we got the new team of the week, Martavius Bryant, this dude is a goon. I usually try to throw it deep to him a lot, but I like have, putting him on like slants and poles, drag routes, because he got, look at that, 93 speed, he can't beat that, man. Of course, we got Brashad Perriman, everybody know why. Mr. 97 speed. Uh, we got Tavon Austin in here, you know. When I need some drag routes, some screens. Um, this Josh Morgan dude, you guys should get him, especially if you love to run the ball. He has like, let me say, 90 strength. Let's look. Somebody told me about him. Look, 90 strength. And yeah, he, he will give your boy some good run blocks, man. A lot of pancakes. We got Brandon Marshall, of course. A run blocking goon. And we got Mario Alfred. This is my little tip for you guys, man. If you guys cannot afford Rashad Perryman, because Rashad Perryman go for like 40k, I want to say. Get this dude. He has 97 speed. Let's compare. Let me see. Let's compare him to Rashad Perryman. Look. He has better spec catch, better release, better route running. But... Alpha guys better catch in traffic and they have almost the same catch in, in the but height can be a factor but it all depends on you man Not, like I said you 97 speed speed is a real factor in this game and Madden 16 speed is a factor we got hard stock because he's good at uh his run block is 91 so I had to get him I just have Ladarius Green there for I don't know what reason <laughs> my quarterback is Tyrod Taylor I'm want to upgrade them because i need to upgrade the quarterback position because there's times people run commit and i have a wire, uh running back open in the flats and he will overthrow them so yeah now here to my favorite position the running blacks you know we got Le'Veon bell uh, i want to upgrade my running blacks man um i either want to get td back or i want to get cj2k flashback cj2k but i don't know i'm gonna have to wait and see but we got Le'Veon. Le'Veon runs hard he is slow you could tell how slow he is but he gets the job done he gets the tough yards this is my sleeper pick if you haven't already this man should be an elite Jarek mckinnon is a goal man 94 speed 97 agility 93 acceleration he can move he makes plays for me yo he makes a lot of plays for me like he used to be my starting running back until I got Le'Veon. This Jerk McKinnon is a beast. I'm telling you guys right now, get him. And we got 75 Chris Johnson. And we got 77 Todd Gurley, which is not a bad card. He's real good too. Um, hopefully in my next lineup update, man, you'll see elites across the board, especially on my line. I need to get more elites on my O line. So I mean I've been doing good so far. I'm in all Madden first string with this line. So time for the defense, man. So check this out. All right, where should I start? We'll start with the corners, man. We got uh, Aqib Tlaib. He's good. He's slow, but good. 
he makes plays. Um, before I got rid of my squad, I had Sam Shields right here, the captain Sam Shields. Um, we got Xavier Rhodes. Can't go wrong with him. This Stephon Gilmore, he'll make plays like at the random times. Like when you wouldn't expect him to make a play, this dude would just come out and show out. <laughs> like I like him. And then we got, of course, Dominic Rogers Cromartie. Even though his press is horrible. I mean, 78 press, my goodness. I try to hold back from pressing, but everything else is good. Like, his man coverage is on point. You cannot go wrong with that in his play rec. I love it. And the speed and the acceleration, he'll hock the ball down. And we got to land a Scantrick. He's pretty good, too. Now to the D-line. This dude, man, I'm telling people, you guys better get this card. His acceleration, especially for, like, people who send out blitzes or whatever. Um, this man has 93 acceleration, so he'll get off the ball real fast. I'm telling you guys, get this dude. We got Marcel Darius. He already know what time it is. He's a beast. We got Brian Robeson. He's real good, too. I think he has a high acceleration, too. Let me, let me check. Uh, it's not showing on here. Hold on. Let's see. Yeah, he has 93 acceleration. That's good, too. Got Aaron Donald. I don't care. This one or the higher one is going to be good. Aaron Donald, his elite cards are good, period. And Damon Harrison, for you guys who do budget squads or still coming up, who started late in month, get you a Damon Harrison. You cannot beat 97 block shed. You can't beat it. 87 play rec, 93 pursuit. You can't beat that, yo. <laughs> you cannot beat that. Oh, also, I would say get a Dan Williams to us. He's pretty good, too. For all you guys who's new. And then we got Jerry Hughes, man. This dude is good. I had um Robert Quinn, but I prefer this Jerry Hughes better. Like, he's real good. The acceleration, the finesse move, and the play rec is real good, man. And then we got Cliff Averill. You know, Cliff Averill is good, too, for the bunch of people. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. My allergies. But, yeah, this um Cliff Averill is good, too. 90 acceleration. The block shit is horrible, but the finesse move, the play wreck, speed is real good. Now to the free safeties. <laughs> got Glover Quinn. Glover Quinn is the GOAT. <laughs> Glover Quinn is the GOAT right now, to me, in my opinion. This man, I swear, like, you cannot throw a ball in his direction and he won't pick it off or contest it. 92 speed, 93 acceleration, 90 play wreck, 94 zone coverage, yo. 94 zone coverage i like to play zone so he's a perfect fit for me we got haha -ha clinton dix i might do the adam Schefter one i just gotta wait to see more reviews okay uh we got nate allen nate allen is good i had will hill you can't go wrong with either or will hill or nate allen these are my strong safeties man i was using will hill for the longest ever since i started playing mutt i had will hill but a lot of people brung to my attention. They was like, yo, try the football outsiders Nate Allen. He is good. And when I looked him up, I was like, okay, 89 speed, 91 acceleration, 81 play rec. You know, because sometimes Will Hill will get beat because Will Hill doesn't have that good play rec like that. But he'll still make plays, especially with the 90 hit power, 87 zone. He can't beat that. But this Nate Allen is good, man. And here to the linebacker. Some of y'all wondering why I have Michael Kendricks right outside linebacker. Uh, I use Shazier because Shazier is faster, I think. So I use her. I use her my middle linebacker. So I just have him on there when I send blitzes or in zone coverages. He's good. Got Jamie Collins. Uh, like I said, we got Shazier. Uh, D'Amico Ryans. I don't know why I got him there. I don't have a second. I don't know who to put that second string middle linebacker. And we got Alec Ogletree. Uh, Derrick Brooks. Derrick Brooks is good, but I'm thinking about. I kind of want to replace him, but I don't know yet. But he makes plays. He makes decent plays. I was really thinking about getting that uh, Captain Bruce Irvin, but I might just end up sticking with him. And then I got Anthony Barr. You guys got to get Anthony Barr, man. Anthony Barr is fast. He is fast. His acceleration is on point. I want to say he's probably... I don't know if he's the fastest. No, he's not the fastest linebacker in the game. Him and... Sh no, never mind. Forget that. <laughs> Forget that I even said that. Before the shades there came out, Anthony Barr was the fastest uh, linebacker in the game. Okay, for my punters, we got Quigley, because Roka suck. So we got Quigley. Um, this McManus, man, this dude could kick from far, from anywhere. Look at that 93 
He can actually 99 kick power, man. Get y'all him, man. You know, for the kick return, we gotta have my boy G Archer, man. He is fast. Everybody knows this man is a glitch, so I gotta put him on the field. Got Tavon also return kicks, and then we have Deshaun Jackson too. So this is the squad, y'all. Um, hope you guys like the video. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Um, if you guys look, want another lineup update, let me know, and I'll give it to you whenever I make some major updates. Um, if you haven't already, check out my Twitch, man. I live stream. It will be in the description. Twitter in the description. And my PSN will be in the description. If you guys want to ask for tips or give tips or, you know, donate or anything, it will be in the description, man. I appreciate you guys. And uh, thanks, man. We out.